Hey everybody, this is Larelia, and today I want to talk about traffic. What do I mean about traffic? I'm talking about how to get traffic to your online business. Now, if you are new to affiliate marketing, you may not know what I'm talking about, and that's why I'm doing this video. So at this point, you may have seen someone's video on YouTube or maybe on social media about how they're involved in this particular program and how they're earning um, X amount of dollars, you know, whether it's hundreds, thousands or what have you. And you may be even on their email list and you've been following this person for a while and then you're wondering, okay, well, how are they doing it? You know, how are they able to generate the income? Because now, since you've been watching this person, you have decided to take action and make the investment to get started. But the small little piece that you don't know is that your ability to get this business going, this online business, this affiliate marketing business going, is that you need traffic. What does that what do I mean by that? You need online, you need eyeballs on your business. You need to have people to look at what it is that you're selling. And that is what I'm going to show you in this video. I'm going to talk about it because a lot of times people do not know that that is the missing element. You know, it, it's not that it's a mystery. It's just a lot of people don't know that it takes traffic to get particular people to look at the offer so let's talk about traffic so i have the word traffic right here on the whiteboard and i want to talk about there's free traffic that you can use and then there is paid traffic now which one is better it really depends on how much capital you have to get started and also do you want to go fast or do you want to go slow now normally if a person is new to online and they start with free traffic that possibly could be YouTube And I just usually like to just put social media, but I'm going to really break down some of the free uh, methods that you can use. It can be Facebook. It can be Instagram. Just going to put IS. And it can even be twitter yes people are still using twitter you will be surprised and so all these methods oops all these methods i meant to click this off and i hit it all these methods right here are free as you can see free but understand that if you're new to online, it can be a bit slow. But the great thing about this free traffic is that a lot of times it is warm traffic. What do I mean about warm traffic? What I mean about that is that normally when a person sees your online offer, and if they are following you or watching you on any of these social media platforms, um, they are going to get to a point where they may know, like, and trust you because they've watched a lot of your content. They see that you're providing value. And so a lot of times these individuals that you get traffic from it's it's considered warm traffic that is what they that is what they call it in marketing there's warm traffic and then there's cold traffic now what would be cold traffic that this would be cold the paid now it's faster but a lot of times 
It is cold. Why is it? Because these people have never seen you before. So some of the ways that you can get paid traffic, it would be from Bing. It could be solo ads. It can be paid Facebook ads. And it can be paid YouTube ads. Now, is one better than the other? No, one is not better than the other. Don't get me wrong. I would prefer warm traffic over cold traffic any day. But remember I said... Do you want to build your online business slow or do you want to go fast? Now, there's no method of what's the perfect model. Remember, at the end of the day, what could work for someone else's business may not work for yours because at the end of the day, we are our own individual person. We are starting all we're starting off all in different places. So, there's never no one who can say, well, pay traffic is much better than slow traffic because there's a lot of things to take into account. Number one, how much capital do you have? Because paid traffic, it does take capital. So if you're new to the online space, do you have any capital? You know, what, what do you have more of? Do you have more time than you have money? Well, if you have more time than you have money, then you may want to do the slower way, which is the free methods. But keep in mind, it takes time because people always wonder, well, what is the, you know, you know, how do I really execute the free traffic? It really is going to be based on you being consistent. And see what happens is, is that when a person gets started online, if they don't get the immediate results, like they see the individual who may be promoting that particular um, affiliate offer, they give up. And so that's why they put their dreams to the side about building an online business. You know, we're living in the new economy. And what do I call the new economy? The new economy is the freelance economy. It's the you economy. It's you having the ability to create your own paycheck. These are the best of times. And now is the best time for you to get started building some type of online business. That is why I'm doing these videos. Now I have a whole nother channel on YouTube and that channel um, primarily deals with credit repair. And I have been able to build a business that pays me consistently um, in the area of a particular niche, which is credit repair and debt management. And I have been able to do that all online because once again I have an offer and I had and I learned many years ago back in 2013 and 2012 that if I want to build my online credit business I need to have traffic so that is why I'm doing this video because a lot of people do not realize that when they get started online the most important thing that they need is traffic and so you need to decide which one is it that you that you are going to do are you going to do free traffic or are you going to do paid traffic do you have capital or do you have more time are you willing to be consistent are you willing to just you know try it today and if it doesn't pay you a thousand dollars by next week you're going to give up you know, it, you know, having an online business is a business. It's not something where you just put the bare minimum in and expect to get a big reward. It doesn't work like that. You know, um, it really takes work. But I wanted to kind of give you an idea 
of you know what a, a new person who's online what does it take because what happens is is that many of us get really you know wide-eyed when we you know when we're new to this online space and then we're wondering okay well how are they getting to the big checks the way they're getting to the big checks is that they understand that the most important thing in their online business is traffic and so in this video that is what i'm going to that's what i talked about about traffic so if you are somebody who is like i said new to online um looking for a bit of hand holding um i have created an online system it's pretty much a blueprint on how you can get started online i'm going to put the link below this video It's going to be the new economy online.com there you will learn um pretty much how to really take an existing um system that's already in place and all you have to do is really execute it yourself it's built on the click funnels platform everything will be right um you know right there for you and so all you need to do is just go to the link below this video to learn more about it and i look forward to talking to you um again um about online marketing okay talk to you in the next video bye bye